what to do aquarius this is y'all personal not personal hold on uh -uh. okay so i just want to say this because i'm picking this up and i know this with aquarius y'all got this bad whoever watches me for aquarius readings everything is not going to resonate for you it's it's not um i just did capricorn reading check out capricorn reading i did have air sign that popped up it's like you aquarius some of y'all gotta really work on everybody ain't out to get you okay everything that me or another reader says or anybody says it's not shade you really need to work on healing because there's somebody yeah ace of swords what i'm saying is the truth it's like whoever watches me especially for aquarius it's like you get you go you unsubscribe you subscribe you unsubscribe you subscribe you feel like i'm throwing shade or like i'm i'm triggering you or provoking you that's not what it is you really need to go heal but let's get started this could resonate with aquarius placement sun moon rising north node venus yeah queen of wands energy what i'm saying is the truth okay but um i feel like there is a masculine energy and this could be who this is about where the woman and her masculine energy okay but this could be even somebody else that is going through this too so let's just put it out there somebody's trying to slow somebody finances down okay somebody's trying to slow somebody money down slow somebody business down um two of pentacles nine of wands hey man queen of cups energy is like um this can even be like two people i feel like somebody really gets in their emotions or really get mad when like for example the fact that somebody is like talking about something There could have been an earth sign woman, possibly a Taurus. Yeah, with the world card energy. I feel like this could be somebody, like, giving birth. Okay, somebody could be dealing with the Pisces. That could be dealing with a fire sign, earth sign, and some type of water sign. Four of wands, page of wands, okay? I feel like there's some type of fighting or conflict within the relationship where somebody wants to come to somebody's house and, like, cause a, a problem, an issue. Four pinnacle and the six of wands the lover's card it's like yeah somebody knows that they need to hold back this could even be somebody that feel like aha i won i i got i got the nigga but i feel like i don't want to be i wouldn't want to be with somebody that cheats on you like yeah ten of wands and it's like the whole time somebody could be like haha i won him i i got the kid i got the car i got the house the whole time you're getting cheated on okay eight of wands energy I'm definitely getting heavy projection with the Eight of Wands. It's like somebody family could be like trying to project something on somebody. This could be somebody that's like in the spotlight of attention. Or it's like somebody could be recognizing like every time they hold back, keep to themselves. Like um, people go through a hard, difficult time. Like they get their karma. It's kind of like if somebody's trying to project negative energy on someone, it returns back to sender. Somebody could be doing return to sender spells. I feel like somebody's definitely protected. They're definitely backed up by, like, their spirit guides, the universe, yeah. I feel like, um, it's this energy of, like, what I was picking up again. It's like, when I say something or, like, another reader says something, somebody takes it too close to heart and they start projecting. And this is somebody I feel like that's, re like, refusing to look at the bigger picture or heal. So, yeah, we got the star card and the page of swords energy. I definitely feel like somebody's spirit guides, like, watches everything, monitor everything. I'm telling you, five of wands, queen of swords energy, it's kind of like, is this smoke? There's really a woman that feels some type of way, but you watch somebody, okay? Yeah, with the nine of cups energy, it's like, there could be a... Aquarius dealing with a Scorpio. Somebody, could, yeah, with the Empress card. It's like somebody views like a divine feminine as, or somebody is mad at a mother energy, or somebody's mad at a sister or divine feminine because they can feel like you're getting all the niggas or you're being an attention seeker. This seems like projection. Like somebody's, I right, look, I right, boom, look. Five of Swords, yeah. It's like whoever this is, I feel like somebody be talking a lot of shit about somebody. Like, oh, they 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 sleep with a lot of niggas, or it's a lot of projection. Yeah, somebody was passing judgment, and it could be why this karma, this Ten of Wands, 
Yeah, I feel like there could be a group of people, like, with the Three of Cups, High Priestess energy. Like, somebody be talking about this person, like, behind closed doors. <clears throat> the Justice card, okay? Definitely could be, like, a... Yeah. Somebody's definitely trying to do spell work or manipulate the situation to work out in their favor. Terrifying energy could be a Taurus, Okay. For some of y'all, it's like somebody hide the fact that they got money. They got money to fix and solve your problem. Somebody could definitely be going to court. Or somebody could be hiding the fact that they were in a marriage. They were in a connection. And they stayed in that connection. Somebody could have been really materialistic too. Like they stayed in that connection for like benefits. Okay. There can even be a celebrity freaking watching somebody too as well. Yeah, just a star, two of swords. Energy. Knight of Cups, two of swords. Somebody can have like a Scorpio block or they need to block one. Okay, I'm definitely getting Aquarius. It could be a Scorpio, very indecisive. Five of Wands energy. I feel like you could be getting a lot of attention right now, or um, it's like you could be into it with a Scorpio, or Scorpio build you with some type of competition. The Hangman energy. I feel like it, it could be like a lot. You could be enlightened about a lot of conflict that's going around right now. That's or that's surrounding you, and it's kind of like with the Three of Pentacles, Five of Wands. It's like whoever this is got somebody in an uproar, or like somebody. It's like doing a lot of fighting, a lot of arguing, a lot of like whatever you do for work could be like very draining, very tiring. It's like um people could be very demanding or like you work in a very competitive workspace. Eight of Cups, Ten of Wands. It's kinda like if something is not somebody's drowning in depression with the Eight of Cups, Ten of Wands. This could be all because of finances, or you may feel like I'm overly independent. I do everything on my own. I just really, really want to break. Or somebody could be going through like a, um, yeah, two of pentacles, nine of pentacles. Somebody could be trying to fluctuate their money or trying to make like a paycheck stretch. Ten of cups energy. So this could definitely be a family member of yours. Okay. Yeah, ace of swords. Listen. Um... This is definitely like a water sign or a Pisces, square pinnacles, ace of swords. There is like somebody holding back information from you concerning like a um, water sign. And this can definitely be like a mother energy. Okay. Yeah, hair fine. It's like in due time, somebody has to tell you some type of truth. I am seeing um, somebody wants to gain some type of clarity about a connection. And this can definitely deal with the Pisces page of pentacles is like um there could be like an earth sign that went to a psychic to get information about like what her man was doing behind closed doors or something and i and i'm definitely getting she wants to bring this to this man like hey like i know what it was i knew what you were doing yeah somebody could have page of wands four of wands some cards like somebody could have like a child on the way or news about a child Three of Swords, and I feel like, yeah, it may break somebody's heart and make somebody feel some type of way. A water sign. Like, somebody may tell, like, a... Okay, so if there's two water signs together, I'm seeing this way, too. Like, there could be, like, a water sign, like, uh, the woman or the man telling, like, each other, like, hey, I have a child. And, like, what? Darnell, what you mean a child? I, I, I got a... I, I, I got a child. I got a child. I'm hearing this may be like a boy. Like the boy may be, I feel like the boy may be like a toddler. It's kind of like, yeah, I left my family behind to, um, yeah. For some of y'all too, it's like if you get in a connection, relationship with somebody else and like you keep this a secret, there's going to be a water sign that's going to feel some type of way. Like grabs chest, yeah. Ace of Cups. It's like this man's the house love for you. If you start something new, this man still is in love with you. Page of Swords is like, even though you stop talking to this person, it's like, Aquarius, this person still thinks about you. It's like, you only focus about your money and your stability. Like, yeah. 
You be focusing on that. Like, that's my only focus. Nine of Cups in reverse. Eight of Pentacles. Queen of Wands. I feel like there could be possibly two siblings into it. Like, two sisters. Or, like, a mom and a daughter into it. Or two, like, friends. It's like one person wants to, like, renew something. And the other is like, bitch, please, bye. I'm focused on my money. You do this shit every time. I'm not into fixing shit. Yeah. And I feel like um somebody's stressing out. Like, wondering, like, can we really fix this? Do you really cut me off? Like, it's really fuck me. Somebody really wants to reconcile with the other. And the other's like, girl, if you don't get the fuck off my doorstep. <laughs> that's the vibe that it's giving. Yeah. And another thing I'm getting, there could be, like, a... um. I'm telling you, somebody could have left somebody and, like, the, the baby mama or the mother, like, bossed up. Or she could have got, like, real spiritual, real grounded. Um, this person could have had a temper. I feel like somebody's, like, real, real calm and mellow now. I'm also getting that there could be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, family. That's, like, they trying to stop, like, the tr a truth from coming out. And this could be like some type of group organization or something that happened at like a group or a building. Like I want to say at a church, school, courthouse, um, the the mail pl place. Like, yeah, it's like somebody family wants to prevent a truth from coming out. And it's kind of like there is somebody that want to make sure they come first and like clear their name. Because it's like, yeah, I feel like there could be a mom that know all about it or somebody's trying to delay something. Somebody could be pregnant with the Empress. Yeah, and I feel like somebody could be hiding this. Hiding that pregnancy. Or you manifesting one. Yeah, don't be so reckless with that, okay? Somebody may even be like, I gotta get rid of it, okay? I do see with the full card energy and the Ten of Pentacles. Beware of, like, starting something new or like wanting to rush fast into a commitment okay take things slow with the nine of pentacles okay yeah take things slow page of pentacles somebody could be going to school for something okay we got like what three more minutes somebody is thinking about going to school going back to school that's definitely a good idea so yeah somebody is hearing something either from a probation officer or, like, some type of court. Or, like, karma is coming in fast. Yeah, I feel like somebody is closing out some type of cycle. And I feel like it could have been long and enduring. And I definitely feel like there's about to be some type of celebration. Yeah, with the song card, it's going to make somebody really, really happy. Um, Yeah. With the death card. Listen. In the whole time, it's like, if somebody's beating the case... This could be a Libra. Somebody is not going to be happy that somebody is beating a freaking case, okay? High Priestess Energy. The Star card. This may be you, Aquarius, or Pisces. It's like, there's a Scorpio that's going to feel some type of way. There's Aquarius, and there's a Pisces that's going to feel some type of way. Like, somebody is going to be over it, or somebody feel like there's some type of injustice. Listen. Somebody is going, there's an air sign, masculine energy, seven of swords. It's like, um, he's been like watching tarot readings or he's like going to travel to like get energy work done or trying to put root work on somebody. Ace of wands. This could definitely be somebody that be traveling, having sex. Six of wands, like, yeah. Somebody's trying to find a way to, like, to confuse somebody or to stir up drama so to prevent two people from, like, reconciling. Be aware, because this could be somebody that's an opportunist. Like, somebody only wants to deal with somebody now for an opportunity. Okay? Um, we got Aries and water signs. So, yeah, there could be an Aries that's in a relationship with a water sign woman. It's like, whoever this is. I feel like this man has been watching the whole time, possibly through a friend page. And it's like, this man is only coming back. And the whole time, he's hiding his relationship. So, where we at? We at, let me go ahead and... So, King of Wands, yeah, this man is very manipulative. My way, the highway, the world car, energy, 
he's still a liar he ain't changed with the moon card okay he's very deceptive um I feel like deep down, this man be really moody. Like, he be in his feelings. He be in his emotions. He really feels some type of way of, like, um, y'all couldn't still do what it is that y'all were doing. I feel like this is somebody who was stringing you along, okay? And it's like this man was really hiding the fact that he was in a whole different connection, a whole different marriage, okay? And with the Seven of Wands... It's like, this would be somebody that would deny even having dealings with you. But, like, they feel some type of way that they can't string you along. And I feel like, yeah, for a source energy, like, you need to pull back from this person. Like, don't sleep with them. I feel like this would be somebody that fuck around and trap you with a baby. They could have, but I feel like something didn't work because the universe, like, back you up. So, with the death card, I feel like you could have lost a child, an embryo. With this masculine energy. Because I feel like this man was like really, really comfortable with just dealing with you. Like he could have been like saving you for later. But he definitely had you in third party situations. I feel like even these third parties could be watching you. Or like there could be a Gemini watching you. There could be an air sign watching you. Like a group of friends. The death card in reverse. This masculine energy feel like y'all. Yeah. He watches you. There's an Aquarius that watches you for him. Or like a masculine energy that could be like really like nonchalant. That like a spy. Because King of Swords kind of give me spy businessmen. Like somebody serious. Like this masculine energy watches you too for him. Probably retreats back to you. But whoever that fire sign is. He um he feel like with a death card in reverse. Like y'all got unfinished business. I feel like this is definitely somebody that was fighting against a like spiritual awakening. So that's all that I have for Aquarius. Okay, if you happen to resonate with this reading, go ahead, like, subscribe, and share. Okay, I am available for personal readings. If anybody's interested in booking me for one, all that good stuff information is in my description below. So let me take my little cat nap or probably just do some schoolwork. You know, big RN. I'm out. Thank you for tuning in.